in Captain Marvel, we have a lot of 90s themes because yes. it takes place in the 90s. We do. You land in a blockbuster. Yes. So I wanted to start off with a few questions about 90s movies to see how well Brie Larson knows the 90s. It's probably better than Carol Danvers. To be clear, people watching this, I was born in 89, so... 91. I, I, they're, they're, you'll, you'll be okay. 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 The Sixth Sense. I want to see if you can finish this line. I see... Dead people. See, it's easy. Woo! Forrest Gump, life is like... A box of chocolates. Two for two. This one's a little harder. It's from Rush Hour. Do you understand the words... That are coming out of my mouth. That's impressive. I do love Rush Hour. That's impressive. Me too. Underrated movie. And this one is one of your co-stars. It's in a movie called A Time to Kill. And he says, yes, they deserve to die. It was Samuel L. Jackson. Because it was him doesn't mean I know it. <laughs> yes, I they deserve to die? It's a, yeah, it's a quick, he's in court, and he says, and I hope they burn in hell. Oh, and I hope they burn in hell. You know, that is dark, but I have heard that before. I just didn't, yeah. yeah. Hmm. No, but okay. I won't tell him. I'll, I won't I'm going to say, once again, I was a child when that came out, so I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> All right, now let's talk about Captain Marvel. Uh, Carol has this incredible will to rise up and overcome and prove herself almost to herself, but also to others. So I'm curious for you, what is... What is your biggest motivator when you run into obstacles like that to keep going and, and overcome and rise up? That's one that I've been thinking about a lot because, I mean, I experienced that a lot in my life and I've experienced that physically on this movie. There are many times specifically with certain stunts where I fully landed in, on my face and had to get back up and try it again. Oh. Um, I don't know. There's just something in me that just can't quit. I don't I don't know. That's like the best and worst part of me, maybe, that I stick it through till the end. And I, I think it's because I always want to learn what my edge is, how far I can possibly go. And I'm learning that I can go way further than I thought. I love higher, further, faster. Higher, further, faster, I yeah. What did you? What is something you learned about the character or about yourself that you found really interesting during production or after watching the movie? Mm, I mean, I think for me it's all about how unapologetic Carol is about her strength. I think that it's a it's a quality that some people might consider cocky, but I call that confidence. And I think seeing a female own herself in this way and for me getting to play a character like that, where you get to kind of own the fact that you're super strong and not apologize for it or play it down, but just be like, yeah, this is who I am, feels really good. One character people really are excited to possibly see in the future, and I think you've talked about this as well, is Goose, Goose was oh. great, but Kamala Khan, mm. who was snuck into a Captain Marvel comic, she was kind of hidden behind the scenes in a panel. So I'm curious, if we look hard enough, might we see her, or is she at least a character you, you really would like to see in the future? Oh, no, she's the character. Is she in the movie? I, I don't know, I'm asking. Oh, you've see you've seen it. Oh yeah, no. The way she's introduced in comics for the first time is she's hidden in a panel. Oh, I see what you're her, saying. And then she appears later, and you can go back and find her. Oh, cool. So I mean, I think you? there's a lot of Easter eggs in this movie that I don't even know about, and I'm sure I'll learn about from other people. Uh, but she's, I mean, I feel like she's the future. So when I've been asked in, about, you know, the future of the MCU or the future of the Captain Marvel series, like I want to be with her. It's awesome. Yeah. And there are some other women you might want to be with, and they want to be with you because Evangeline Lilly, Denai Guerrera, other Marvel heroes oh, yeah. have been very vocal about wanting Tessa, mm -hmm. that Avengers. Yeah, uh, we want that. Would, are you ready to lead that team? What do you think that would be like? Duh. I mean, I feel like they have to elect me. We were, we've were we been talking about this, about like what our democratic system would be as to who gets to be the leader, or if there even is one, and maybe we can all coexist happily. We don't need to have... A, specific leader but if they nominated me for that of course I'm, I'm in I love it and you you had to grow up really fast with this role because you have this movie but you also were shooting Avengers as well so I'm curious what was that like because you're making your debut but also filming one of the biggest movies with an ensemble cast that's been doing it for a while so what was that experience like oh it was great I mean a lot of those actors like I've known for a while so um it was great, like, my first real introduction being, like, the Captain Marvel 10-year anniversary photo where I had, like, every character at my fingertips. So I was able to just, like, ask stupid questions and um, feel like I was joining this this giant family and that I had a support team because it felt a little weird being like, I'm doing this by myself. I mean, luckily I had Sam with me, who I've done two films with previously, so I knew I had a pal going into it, but it felt a little scary to be like off on my own doing this thing for the first time. I love it. And, and I just one last question. There was a part in the movie, and I think you'll know what I'm talking about. I hope so. Where I looked at my friend Anna and I said, Thanos just expletive his pants <laughs> uh, so do you think the mad titan should be a little worried mm -hmm. you should definitely be worried she's, i mean if no. he's not already yeah <laughs> uh, you should be worried i don't know if you've seen the trailer but he should be worried <laughs>